It's a, uh, you know, you'll set up that uh, Top Gun flight school. And I go, man, how come the Space Marines, man, they get the little guy with the halo suit in the corner with the regular Marine guy next to him? What about the Army? Well, I'll tell you what. The Space Marine guy, you know. We got the United Space Navy with nuclear submarines underwater. The Walters and the Walters, you know. And we got United Space Agency, and Star Trek, you know. We really got spaceships up there, in case you guys didn't know. And then, uh, you know, we got the Air Force doing moral support, and, uh, air shows, and angel stuff and alien stuff, you know, up in the air. We got the Army doing logistics. We got the Navy SEALs going in and rescuing people with you know, support system and helping out logistics and logistics helping them out and everything else. And then we got the Marines, you know. They used to say, the few, the proud, the Marines. And it sounded like a bad joke, but it's the truth, you know. Because few of them made it, and they're proud to be here. But some of them kind of got left behind because they didn't have a whole lot of skills. History, not hate, it's the truth, you know. They're like they're bronze and needing the brains, you know. So that's why they have the Navy Cross. You know why? Because the Navy. You know, they're friends with the Army, you know. We always help the Army logistics out, and logistics help us out. And we help the Air Force out with the Navy ships. And then we had the Marines. And they didn't know about it. It's top secret stuff, you know. We got a joke, a friendly joke between the Navy and the Marines. We're like, you know what happens with the Marines when they ride on the Navy submarines? They jar their heads, man. Like, I can't believe it. Oh my God. It's almost like some New York Italian stuff. Like, oh, I can't believe it. The guy, he does a thing, you know. We don't know who he is. It's just the guy, you know. Under the Brooklyn Bridge with the Navy flag, we're out there in the desert. We don't know. But we do it for him. They go, man. Yeah, Space Marines, man. The Navy Cross. Joint operations. Some of those Space Marines were the first in and the last out. Because the first on the field was the new international version. And Navy SEALs went in and set up operations and intel talking to the army the army yeah, they send in the marines so like you know everybody abandoned ship you know like the big earth satellite and went up into space wait for the nuclear cloud of dust and radiation to settle so we could fix the planet well then there was some violent stuff you guys seen that movie 100 you know 100 man they really did they, they sent like a hundred of them space marines down Ooh whole planet thought it was like prisoners landing or something man you wouldn't believe the stuff they did to those space marines you know united states you know united space system was up there with the satellites you know trying to put psychology out so people could learn to think again and them space marines are down here on the ground like man they butchered us they shot at us they blew us up we're doing all kinds of stuff man we're like the body count for the zombie walking man it's like going on that's why the Top Gun Flight School, by God, there better be a Halo Space Marine suit in a corner next to one of those outfit, regular Space Marine guys in regular uniform. You know, they say you're not supposed to wear your uniform in public, so you wear regular clothes instead of the space suits, you know. That's the Space Marines, you know. The top secret missions, you know, with the United States Navy. Now you know why I say. It better be a halo suit and a corner over there with a space marine guy standing next to it going, yeah, man, we're not the few, they're proud. The marines no more. We're space marines and we are many. You see? Yeah, I told you. Some of the history, they forgot about it. So right now and then, we got to talk to the, you know, the safety box, you know. It's like the flight recorders, you know. Those space aliens and angels, man. Look. You see a double A, man. Driving by. You see that? I'll tell you. 
It's like some quantum mechanics most people can't understand, but we're here helping. That's what we're here to do, man, to serve you guys education and intelligence. You know, they made rap songs about it, you know, the black history stuff, you know? You hear the rap and they're like, E-I-E-I-Ho! You know, like land ho, man. Land ho, you know, the Navy captains used to say. I know throughout all the years, the folk tales and stuff, people forgot. It was like, educational intelligence? It's like, yeah, man, we had folk songs. We used to sing about it, so, you know, we were making sure nobody forgot, you know? It's like a Navy captain come over, a new land, try to help everybody, and like, hey, land ho! And they're like, it's like, well, in case they forget, you know, can you break these letters apart into words, you know, later on, like E-I-E-I-O? And I was like, you know, well, old McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, man, education, intelligence all around for everybody. Hey, man, how you doing, brother? All right. He's like, man, look at this guy in the wheelchair. He's, look, it's drive time, man. He's like, I got to drive. Everybody got to drive. We'll walk around, riding wheelchairs, cars, bicycles, whatever we got to do. We educating, man. See what I mean? Quantum mechanics, man. They're black, white, pink, brown, purple. The aliens, some of them have green skin, man. You don't know. You guys ever see that one? Aquaman? 